and today I will be explaining the configuration of InfoType menu. So this InfoType menu is present on the PA30 screen that is T-Core PA30. So these are the menus Core Employee, Cross Net Payroll, Net Payroll and Planning Data. These are the InfoType menus and these are the InfoTypes which are included in this. So to con the configuration path for this is personal management, personal administration and then infotype menus. So we will directly go to the screen. So under personal administration, this is the infotype. There is customizing procedures and then infotype menus. Now under infotype menus, I will click on infotype menu. So these are the menus. So this the first, second, third and fourth were already present on the PA30 screen. So what we'll do is we'll add more in this because these input type menus are already configured. So we'll, I will show you how to add more input type menus here with the info types. So this is the info type menu 01 core employee info user dependency is ticked and this is the reference 01 so now I will be selecting this one 12 benefits which has reference 01 I will be adding this so remember this the menu is 12 we go back and click on info type menu now menu is 12 so here you can see 12 benefits but it is blank there is no info type added here so I will do it as new entries so our user group is 40 for India So the number is 01 is a serial number. The info type I want to add is actions. So I'm saving this. I have added only one info type here. You can add how many you want. Save. go to the next step that is determine choice of info type menus now here this menu is 01 HR master data which we will be using this is the reference number for this is 01 this was already configured Okay, so remember this 01 HR master data. Second step is info type menus. Now we will be adding the info type menu in this 01 HR master data. This is the menu HR master data with reference user group 01. So these are the user groups. But we, our user group is 40. So these are the info type menus. 
which are already present on the P30 screen. So I'm going to add one more in this. So what I'm doing is I'm copying this. So this is already there. I'm changing the serial number for this six. And input of menu which we created for user group 40 was benefit. So I'm adding it as 12. See the menu here is 12 benefits. Then we save this by entering. So this is added here in the HR master data. Save this. So we have completed the configuration for info type menu. Let's see whether it is reflecting here. So this was the PA30 screen which was already opened. So one, two, three, four, five. There are five info type menus here. So let's see whether the menu which we added benefits reflecting. Okay, so you can see here this info type menu is added here with the info type actions because I had configured only for actions info type. You can add as many as you want. So this is the configuration for info type menu on the PA30 screen. If you like my video, please subscribe and share thank you